Rhoda Bergen is 14 years old, the age when a Kazakh of the Altai must master a hunting eagle. Rhoda goes to see his uncle, Sheikh Pauli, an important member of the Jantiki clan. He lives in the district of Delun in Western Mongolia. Sheikh Pauli is a white beard, the Kazakhs' affectionate nickname for their elders. He is also an eagle trainer and is famous throughout the entire Olgi province. Pauli is one of the last masters who knows how to train Altai eagles to hunt wolves. <laughs> this ancestral practice left a tremendous impression on Marco Polo, who described it in the late 13th century. <laughs> Training eagles to hunt wolves perpetuates the Kazakh tradition that unites the three great predators of the Altai, wolf, man, and the royal eagle. The bird of prey personifies the intrepid soul of the warriors. The Kazakhs generally capture female eagles, which are stronger and more ferocious than the males. It is also easier for them to show tenderness towards a female eagle. In a traditional culture, where men rarely express their feelings towards their own wives in public, In early summer, Pauli and Roda head into the mountains in search of a young eagle for the apprentice hunter. Pauli has spotted a balapan, an eaglet that has not yet taken flight. Pauli gives Rhoda some last-minute advice to help the boy capture the precious companion that fate has set before him. The harsh valleys in the western foothills of the Altai, at an altitude of 2,500 meters, are home to the Kazakh people and to the royal eagles. The mother is probably out hunting for her eaglet. Rhoda has to take the balapan before she returns. The young bird of prey is a royal eagle of the Altai. When fully grown, she will weigh a dozen kilos and have a wingspan of two and a half to three meters. Oh, 
Bayka bir anda arkamda sarası koymaya karar. Üretim muhtap oldu, yekili oldu. Bir gün sonra bakıp değil mi? Başka bir şey oldu. Bu olsun. Ah, doğru. Bu olsun. Bu olsun. Hoppla. Hoppla. Bana bak oğlum benim de. Gelsin bana koy. Hastık bayt hastık mı? Vay gelme etse. Ay caksım oğlum. Caksım oğlum. Bak. The eaglet is panting. She's thirsty. As soon as they get home, they'll give her something to drink. Rhoda is lucky. It's a beautiful female. Her talons are powerful, her wings full and well proportioned. According to a Kazakh proverb, the eagle dispels the darkness in the heart of man. An eagle brings light to a household. <laughs> the Balapan gets used to the animals in the herd. She must not view the goats and sheep as prey. During communist rule, the herds were confiscated and became part of collective farms. Migrations were cut back, and the itineraries were determined by a centralized planning system. economy. Many Kazakh farmers, like Pauli, bought back their herds and returned to their ancestral way of life. <laughs> 